Well, here we are in Melbourne. We're very excited about the President's Cup. We've got a PGA Tour winner, a two-time President's Cup player in Pete Lonard. It's such a big event to come to Melbourne Town. It's great for the, the game and it's great for the city, Pete. Yeah, it's a, you know, it's a magnificent event. You get the best golfers in the world uh, coming down and playing one-on-one. -on -one. So it's an interesting format. It's a little different from a normal tour, tour event. And, uh, you know, always brings the best out of them. So we'll uh, see how they go. Mm. And it's always good to take on the Americans and try and beat them. They're, they're a strong team, as are the internationals. Yeah, I, you know, the last few years, uh, well, the two President's Cups I played in, they, uh, I think we had a tie and we got dusted in the last one at Washington. So, uh, you know... It's, it's one of those games, one-on-one, -on -one. I suppose on paper they're probably a better team, but one-on-one, -on -one, anything can happen, match play, and uh, you know they play foursomes, which is a bit of a crazy game as well. What's it like when they come together? You know, it's an individual sport, but then all of a sudden you get in this team environment. What, what's it like in, 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 in the camp? Well, it's, a, it's an unusual format because, you know, you just play for yourself. So, you know, my, like 30 years I've been playing... You know, if I'm taking a risk, I'm taking a risk for myself. And if I hit in the water, well, that's the way it goes. But all of a sudden you're playing, you know, and you're actually hitting your mate in the water or, you know, your partner or whatever, and then he's got to deal with it. So uh, it's an unusual feeling standing over the shots. And uh, But it's one of those ones where if you get on a roll, it, you can really get it going. And if you uh, if you get going backwards, it can be become a pretty hard game. You mentioned the tie that, that you're involved in. Uh, there's only been one win for the internationals, and that was here at Royal Melbourne. Does the course bring them back into it for, for this year's event? I th well, I think playing Australian conditions definitely helps the uh, internationals, particularly if the course is it gets really hard and firm and the greens are fast. And, of course, if you get a couple of northerlies and southerlies, uh, yeah, Melbourne can throw up anything, so it can, you know, it can be... You can play a northerly one day, southerly the next day. Course plays totally different, totally different clubs. So the guys that have played here more often will probably get the benefit of the of the green. Everyone here in Australia is excited because Tiger Woods is down under. Do you think it was the right decision, Tiger? He, you know, given that he's captain of the US team, uh, deciding that he'd play as well. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to be honest. Like if I was a captain and I could pick Tiger, I'd, <laughs> you know, you'd be a pretty crazy person not to pick him so uh you know i've got no problem with him him picking himself i think you know nowadays they have like captains and vice captains and you know so realistically you know he can leave all that picking players and teams and they they sort of pick themselves really but you know to look after the the team side of it and he can just go play golf i think it's a you know he's a, he's a he's an inspiration to the game the way he's come back you know and if he gets it going you know the team can run off the back of him and off they go Great memories for you for President's Cup, a great time in your career and fantastic to have you here with us uh, for this, year, this year's edition for the President's Cup, Pete. Enjoy. Thanks, mate. Hoping for an international win.